up, allies? Happy Saturday. This is like the first time I'm pre-recording my video and not doing it two hours before I go to sleep on a Saturday. So, good for me. Not like it's gonna be any better, but I don't know. I feel like I deserve a pat on the back. Anyway, this week's topic is what have you done this week to help an LGBT member of the community? Um, so the obvious answer, I guess, would be this. Um, YouTube. Um, I hope that my words in some little way help you, give you advice, or I have no idea. Um, but yeah, other than this, um, I don't know, I thought about it, and it's not really, the thing that I came up with is not really something that I do. It's not, I, I guess, uh, that doesn't make any sense. Though. It's not really like an act, like something on my agenda that I check off my little list. It's more like a, the kind of person that I am already, and it's just a part of me, part of my personality. And that's basically just helping others who are new to the community or transitioning into the community, I guess, um, feel at ease and have that little voice that says that it's okay and everything. Um, and by that I mean like, when people are going through that phase where they're confused and they're deciding like, am I gay, am I straight, am I whatever, and um, you know, it can be a very conflicting time and I've been there, I think we've all been there, and when I was going through it, I did have a friend who was there for me who was already out and kind of helped me, talk me through it and made me feel okay. And the thing that I stress the most when I'm talking to these kinds of people is that you have to come out to yourself before you can come out to others and really accept that being LGBT is who you are. And there's really nothing more important than just coming to terms with yourself. And you have to be able to accept yourself before others can accept you. So that's really what I do. I just try my hardest to be that person that will be supportive of whoever it is and whatever they're going through. Um, because it is tough when you're on the borderline of n not really knowing where you're at in terms of your sexuality. And it could be a tough time, so um, this isn't really a thing that I do on a weekly basis. I, like, I don't, this, the answer isn't very specific to this week. It's just something that I do when it comes up, I guess. Um, like I said, it's not something on a checklist that I do every week. It's just part of who I am and part of what I feel I should do for others. Um, so yeah, um, if any of you viewers, subscribers are going through these similar things, I'm just one message away. And I promise I'm not a scary person, I'm very friendly, so um, yeah, if you need any advice or whatever, somebody to talk to, I'm definitely there. Um, so yeah, that's my answer, and uh, I will see you guys next Saturday, and I hope you guys have a good week until then. Bye.